Basically, a robotic arm is a mechanism that allows a robot to reach over and either grab something or interface with something in its environment. When we're designing an arm, we start out with just a basic um, line drawing, a quick sketch. So we just want to, at least first, figure out how long the arm's gonna be, how long the links, how long the joints are gonna be. So we might just do a bunch of lines connected with dots, a very rough sketch. And then later on, once we figure out um, all of the, the general dimensions of the arm, then we'll start filling in more details, um, like how thick is the arm gonna be, what do the joints look like, what do the motors look like, what do the wires look like? So we start off with a very broad um, concept. If we want to build an arm, we need to be able to draw out the concept, communicate that concept to other people, and also analyze that concept. So we will either do a model of it, either in a computer, um, and you've probably seen animations of robotic arms moving things around, or we'll actually build a physical model which is uh, almost like a prototype, which could be plastic or it could be made out of metal. And uh, that would allow us to actually test out the robotic arm and feel how it might respond in the types of environments that uh, we eventually want to use it in.